Susan Hunt spent much of her career traveling the globe as a host, producer, and director. Working for more than half a dozen major networks, Susan gives life to a body of sports, travel, science, medical, and lifestyle programming. She broke ground for women, including being the first female to report from NFL and NHL locker rooms. Susan was the first woman to do play-by-play -play for women's tennis and the first female voice of ABC Wide World of Sports. She created and hosted the first women's sports programs, LPGA Magazine on ESPN, and years later, co-hosted Golf Chicks Radio on Sirius XM. But her media career began in Buffalo Radio in sales at WGR and traffic at WYSL. She started on the air as a morning news anchor at WFXZ-FM before returning to WGRAM as news co-anchor and sports reporter. WGRZ-TV noticed and hired her as a feature reporter and anchor during Sabres telecasts. She is perhaps best remembered, though, by Western New York audiences as co-host of PM Magazine. Susan and I met um, on PM Magazine. Um, I was an intern there, and then my first position I got those as a production assistant for uh, PM Magazine. Susan would do any job that you asked her to do. Susan would go out and climb a tree. She jumped out of an airplane, which I thought was pretty amazing. I mean, we did everything and anything. And we worked like 16-hour days together, and it was the best part of our lives. She was also Sandy Beach's morning news anchor on WHTTFM. And I had seen Susan. I didn't know her, but I had seen her on PM Magazine. I thought she was fabulous. It's, uh, she's one of those charismatic personalities that just jumps out of the TV set. I knew we had to have her for the morning show. We thought we'd have a little fun and have an ugly bride contest where people sent in every week the picture of the ugliest bride in the Buffalo News. Well, we thought we'd go the extra mile and check out to see how thorough the Buffalo News was. So we decided to make me a bride. And Susan was a big part of that. Susan brought in the gown that I wore she brought in the tiara that I wore, and she did my makeup. She made me into a bride. And let me tell you something, I've never felt prettier. Working with Susan Hunt, I guess it's like being a member of the bomb squad. Uh, you never know if you're going to come home at the end of the day. Because it wasn't scripted, and, and we didn't really know where we were going to go, occasionally you knew if you hit a nerve, oh, this was going to be golden, because she was going to come back at you full tilt boogie. After making the move to network television, Susan's national career took off with the Fox Network series, Beyond Tomorrow. This led to her association with the Discovery Channel, as host of many travel shows. Susan also fronted the international travel channel series, Tennis World. Susan has enjoyed a 20-year relationship with the Los Angeles-based reality television production company, Pie Town Productions. We've known Susan Hunt for as long as we've had Pie Town, which is 21 years. Actually, she was the talent on our first television show, and she was already a part of the show, and we were auditioning for her. And luckily, she chose us and made the right decision. And 21 years later, we're very thankful for that. And the rest is history. We're very proud of Susan for being inducted into the Buffalo Hall of Fame. If there's anybody that deserves it, it's Susan Hunt. In front of the camera or behind it, whether it's lifestyle or sports programming, Susan continues to deliver a strong sense of what's next with authenticity and passion. Congratulations, Susan. Here's a challenge. I'm going to be on the air tomorrow morning at 9. I want you to come in to WBEN. We'll let you right in without any kind of security clearance. And I'd like you to sit in with me and see how tough you are. You used to be good. Let's see if you're still good. The Buffalo Broadcasters Association is proud to induct Susan Hunt into the 2016 class of the Hall of Fame.